Well, hello and a very warm welcome to Bharata First. You're watching FRP Explains and I'm Frank Rausen Pereira. Since you're here, please like the video, subscribe, hit the bell icon and share the content as well so that more people get to know about Bharata First. Moonlighting. The term has been in the news of late and it seems to be the talk of town as far as IT hubs are concerned. Well, it has nothing to do with science fiction or celestial objects nor does it have anything to do with fire. Well, uh, that may not be entirely correct because if you indulge in moonlighting, it so seems that you're likely or in all probability will get fired. What is moonlighting? Moonlighting is basically working two jobs at the same time. As a result of the pandemic, we've seen that uh, Working from home has become, uh, you know, almost widespread and all IT companies have uh, resorted to working from home. Many IT companies now have restarted work, some of them contemplating on whether they should have full time employment in the office itself because of this thing called moonlighting. What is it? It's basically when you're under contract with one company, say for instance, an IBM, you take up a job with a competitor and without informing your uh, company, that is the, in this uh, instance, IBM, you work for a competitor and you take salaries from both places and you don't do justice to the first job that you've held is what moonlighting is. Basically, it's two timing, two timing, your organization or your company. And those are the words that, uh, with, uh, that Infosys has used in a stern message that was sent out to all its employees last week that you cannot two-time your organization and you cannot have an illicit relationship so as to speak because uh, this the IT companies believe is a massive problem. IBM too has said that uh, moonlighting will not be taken lightly. Uh, it is a big problem as far as the company is concerned and it does not want any of its employees indulging in it. Uh, the contract <coughs> very clearly states that uh, employees will not work or will not speak or relate to any of the competitors. And if anyone is found guilty of not abiding by the contract, stern action will be taken against them is what Wipro is, uh, is what IBM has said. Now Wipro has gone on further and has already sacked 300 employees thus far because they have indulged in moonlighting and uh, Rishad Premji who's the chairman of Wipro it has been in the news of late because he's been speaking about this quite vocally he also tweeted about it some time back and hence this term moonlighting came into uh, the news and uh, the rest of the country started speaking about it as well now uh, even though most of the companies are on board really with regards to moonlighting and do not want any of their employees to indulge in it, there has been an alternative take that has been provided by another tech giant that is Tech Mahindra's uh, CEO, CP Gurnani has said that these are changing times and we need to evolve with what are pre-existing conditions and maybe some kind of disruption is required in the market and he has not entirely and uh, you know uh, supported moonlighting but he has called for some kind of uh, disruption he says disruption is the most common thing as far as businesses are concerned and when there is disruption there's a stir in the market and we see something positive coming out of it so what are your thoughts really as far as moonlighting is concerned you know should it be allowed should it be indulged in how do people go about it it also ensures at a time at a difficult time that um, there is a multi, that there's another or multiple sources of income too which really helps the individual where do i stand as far as this issue is concerned as long as it is not affecting the company as long as it's not affecting the work and as long as it's not affecting um, time management I don't think there should be a problem as far as a person working in two different places is concerned because it gives this particular individual a legitimate right to try and make 
you know an extra living for his family try and save up for the future because we've all been through really difficult times and we know how difficult jobs are to come by so probably it's something that could be allowed maybe some kind of an agreement can be reached between the employee and the employer and it can be worked out but as things stand right now it doesn't look like it is something that can happen anytime soon and it doesn't look like the employers are very happy about their employees rendering their services uh, in two different places let me know you let me know what you think about this issue should it be allowed should it not be allowed how can we work out work this out what kind of a framework should we see moonlighting in case we do want to see it and uh, where do you stand on this issue i'd like to hear your thoughts on this as well please let me know in the comment section below that's it on this edition of frp explains but since you're here please like the video subscribe hit the bell icon and share the content so that more people get to know about bharata first and don't forget to support us in any way possible and thank you for all the support that you've shown across these uh, you know these couple of years that bharata first has been in existence that's it for me see you again next time Thank you.